Yu-Gi-Oh! Chaos Season 1 wasn't chaotic enough for you, well, this season, I've thrown all semblance of logic out of the fucking window. This season, every card from Yu-Gi-Oh! and Magic the Gathering. Myself and Nick from Demura Tuntra will be given lots of 80 random cards to work with. Every episode will be a new set of cards to work with, and a new set of cards to not understand. Welcome to Yu-Gi-Oh! Chaos Season 2. Alright, if we don't pull the most broken pool known to man, I will cry. I will cry a lot. So if we don't get like just some insane stuff, I am rerolling instantly. So hopefully, fingers crossed, this gives us the tools to compete once more. Okay, Abyss Hector, Blackwing, Bakoichi, mm. Catnip Kitty, Cyber Dragon Core, Decider, Dora Fate Dotscaper. Drowning Mirror Force is incredible. Oh my, that's really good actually. Um, Longirsu. Can we make Longirsu? I don't know if we have any Orcists. Ah, uh, I can't make that guy. True Graco Phoenix, maybe. Well, look into it. Most Recarnation's okay. Cellphone's funny. Ah, uh, Nunu is not very good. Starving Venom? Oh, we don't have Super Poly. Oh, we don't have Super Poly. That sucks. Can I trade my coins for a Super Poly? Hmm. Interesting. Um, Thought Ruler Archfiend, you know, is ruling over me, and Rottweiler. Okay, so there's some pretty good Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Let's go into those MTG cards and see what's good. Because we got a lot of them. And I'm actually going to do a little thing that I like to call. Actually looking up what these cards do before I lock in my pool. Okay, so we got some really, really good uh, stuff in this set. So I am definitely locking this in. Let's see what I can do to mess with Chu a little bit, shall we? Okay, so unfortunately, unfortunately, Chu will not let me be a funny guy and buy Super Poly for my Starving Venom. So instead, we're just going to sell a couple cards, and then we will, uh, you know, do the thing and ban something of his. Just sold 26 things, that means that, uh... We're going to ban a card. Now, we're going to look through his pool yet again. And I think we are going to ban. I believe I banned Wrench Mind last time. So I think we're going to ban the funny card that makes me ask permission for everything because that's just not fun to play with. So that is being banned. I am surprised, yet yeah, kind of not, but I'm surprised that your deck won. So, like, so... What's the word I'm thinking of? Like, so, it, 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 fuck, fuck, uh, predominantly, dominantly or whatever the fuck. I'm surprised it won so well, um, considering I was expecting to kind of, like, brick a bit, but anyways, welcome back to Yu-Gi-Oh! Chaos. We're currently on a, another win streak, and it's, it, it, it's kind of looking bleak for, uh, your, uh, boy Nick. So, let's see if we're going to keep up this streak, or if Nick's going to finally get something cracked. Let's do our pools. Appliancer Conversion and Launcher Dragon. Yo! Time to pull the appliancers, baby! Um... Clavis is interesting. We, once again, don't have a Destiny Hero F... Uh... Guardian Slime's interesting, might be pretty good. Um, Violent Honor Arc is good. Hope Harbinger is good if we can reliably get out like eight. Pacifist, Stranger Falcon. Ooh. Stranger Falcon is pretty decent. Wait, no, that's the XCs, isn't it? Stranger is one of the fives, I think. Eh. Uh, some interesting cards here this week. I don't know if we've got. Some, I don't know if we've got a ton of stuff that will make the main deck though. As for the MMTG cards, let's take a peek. All silvers have this creature deals two damage per creature player and deals three damage to itself. That's interesting. We have another silver card, but it's not that good. 
we got... I don't think we got a, any good uh, magic cards this week, which is unfortunate. Um, we'll have to look deeper into the Yu-Gi-Oh cards and see what we can add. But I guess let's see what we're cooking up this week. Okay, so we got some pretty good stuff this week. Let's start with our monster lineup. Our only two changes are Dotscaper. So he's a free special summon if you summon from the graveyard. 2100 defense, he's a good guy to set. And then if he's banished for whatever reason, I can special summon again. So he's good for making link plays. Helps he's an effect monster too, so I can actually use him to make like Boral Sword and stuff. We also have Palukronos. Okay, so when I just battlefield with six plus one plus, sorry, the Palukronos enters the battlefield with six 400 400 counters on it. That makes it a 2400 normal summon. Then it can escape with 12 of these counters on it. What is escape, you might ask? Escape is what we will come to later. But it also has the effect, if damage we dealt to it, just remove that many counters instead. So if it gets too weak, I can just use it for a link summon. Um, then once per turn, I can have it fight something else. So basically what would happen is a, it's basically a combat phase without any combat happening and no one loses life. Then I can exile six other cards from my graveyard, special summon it. That's what escaping is. So I can exile six cards, bring it back, and it's, uh, what's, like a, like a, like a 4800, 4800? It's pretty good. Pretty good. Now let's get into spell cards, because we got, we got some good stuff. First, clairvoyance, quick effect. Uh, look at target player's hand, then I can draw a card in the next turn's upkeep. Pretty good. We also have foreboding fruit. Draw two, pay 800. Not bad, I can make anyone do it. So for some reason, Chu has, like, one card left in his deck. Well, that boy is getting decked out. Then my favorite inclusion, Narset's Reversal, quick effect, copy target spell card, then return it to its owner's hand, I may choose new targets for the copy. copy. Basically this reads, counter target spell, then I get to use the spell instead. We also have Tasha's Hideous Laughter. So each opponent banishes cards from the top of the deck until they have banished cards with total levels of 20 or more. Seeing as this deck is mostly spells, we're going to be banishing a lot of stuff. Uh, we've also added Wild Stream, so pay X life, uh, where X is 500 per... X, banish it, but I get to return that many cards from my graveyard to my hand. Not just monsters, cards. Then of course, Drowning Mirror Forest, Stable, and Sense of Divine Top. So this is a trap card in this format. Once per turn, look at the top three of my deck, put them back in any order, then I can draw a card and put this card on top of the deck. Pretty good. Sideboard. We've actually added Curse Seal, the Forbidden Spell, to the sideboard because of how good choose spell cards are. So this is a very important add. We have added Arcane Library Laboratory to the sideboard, so each player can't cast more than one spell per turn. Might come up. We moved Soul Charge to the sideboard just because I don't get enough use out of it, unfortunately. I can't OTK with it, so yeah. And I think that covers everything, so fingers crossed we, uh, we do well. Oh yeah, also we removed one of our extra cards for Starving Venom. Next week if I lose, I'm definitely buying a Poly. Alright, see you in the games. So we're once again on like this Earth Beat deck because it performed so well last time, despite Calcifita having done absolutely nothing. It's still a decent card considering it floats off of one of my Earths, getting destroyed by Battle or Card Effect, and then sends something like Plague Spreader or um, Gub. So I honestly think the Earth deck has some decent synergies that I really like, despite the fact that we, you know, had to remove the Cypress package to be able to play this, really. So, uh, going over the card by card, we have Calcifita, Cyber Dragon, Glow of Bulb, uh, Ice Fang Quaddle, Lurfagoyf, uh, Lurgoyf, whatever the fuck this is called. It's a decent normal summon that can get really fucking massive, so I'm hoping this is gonna be, like, a nice inclusion to the deck. Uh, Machina Gearframe, Mathematician, Whip Snake, Plague Spider Zombie, Psychic Commander, React Tan, Silent Psychic Wizard, Soul of the Harvest, Squirrel Dealer, Super Nimble Mega Hamster, Tet Seamock, Lithosagum, UA Perfect Ass, Void Beckoner, Arabellum, Acton Impulse, Army of the Dam, Betrayal Flesh, Brilliant Plan, Contradict, Endless Obedience, Git Probe, Him a Rebirth. Reverse Engineer, Skull Rend, Skull Tap, Split Decision, Thrill of Possibility, Tragic Lesson, Vanquish the Horde, Violent Ultimatum, Azorius Locket, Defense Draw, Floodgate Trap Hole, and Spare Supplies to round out the main. Um, I don't believe the side deck really changed, but we have Brain Weevil, Brachion, Troll, Ghost Mourner, Jinzo, Snowman Eater, Blade Brand, Berry and Books, Cradle to Grave, Enlarge, Stratagem, Serenity, Victim of Night, Broken Line, and the Trap Dust Shoot. The extra deck has a new 
one or two new inclusions. Um, we have Trish, Leonite, Cataster, Life Transfer, RDA, Ruddy Rose Dragon, Yoku the Grace of Maikashi, Alucard, King of the Feral Imps, the Global Chain, Silent Honor Arc, Hope Harbinger, because we can actually make it because we do have a couple eights, Black Ship of Corn, Avermax, and Space Insulator. So that's going to round out our deck. Let's see how we perform this week. Decent pulls. I pulled everything I wanted except for the uh, 001. I can just buy one of those. I thought, I thought you were like talking 13. about your chaos pools, and I was like, what the fuck? Oh, no, 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 no. Out of my uh, thing. I got a bunch of Tenyi stuff, which is good, because I want to build pure Tenyi. You know what kind of sucks for me? Uh, so, oh. I ordered Hulk like, mm -hmm. the day uh, I went on TCG Player, because I was like, oh, this thing's going to spike in price. I pulled one mm -hmm. from my Ghost, and I looked up on TCG Player. It's like three bucks. Yeah. Kind of sucks. Just sold mine when it was eighty. True, true. But anyways, I got the ghost rare red eyes looking over me, so uh, I'm bound to win today. It's Inshallah, so beautiful too. It was a little, uh, win. Oh, there's a little weirdness with the uh, foiling, and that one corner is missing foiling. Ooh, that's when I knock you off like a PSA grade or Let's two. Let's go, baby. SMH, how, how dare you beat me in RPS? I'm just that good. Yup. Um. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this thing's not great. Uh, Plus I, normal a 2k my, body. Mine's we'll pretty good. One, my hit's pretty good. Pass. Okay. Uh, Alright, I'm gonna start with, uh, you know, standby phase, I'm gonna tragic lesson. Draw two, then pitch one. Okay. And you get to sell the hardest, okay? Alrighty, baby. Main one. When you're good, you're good. Hang on, before you draw, put that back. Oh? Put it back. Unactivate Narset's reversal. Copy target spell or turn to his owner's hand. I choose new target for the copy. How the fuck does this work? So basically, I copy it, it negates your effect, and it goes back to your hand. So then I can just activate it again? Correct, but I still get three cards in my hand. I'm going to activate it again, so we will both get to draw three cards. Yeah. Unfortunately, uh, there's no mana in this, so you can just be like, haha. Haha. -ha. Alright. <laughs> That's disgusting. Alright, I'm going to start with a special summon of Cypher. Okay, in response, I'm going to silence you. In response, I'm going to split decision. Okay. Uh, yeah, flip the coin. Tails, baby, tails. Ah. Alrighty. Well, when you're good, you're good. Alright, have fun. Yup, I'm gonna Endless Obedience Soul Harvest. Cool. Normal Summon Mathematician. Activate the effect. Yup. Uh, sending... Do I want to send Plagues or Gub? We'll send plagues. That not where that was supposed to go. Dueling book memento. True. Uh, because I summoned a card, uh, I will draw a card off the of soul. Then I will special plagues by stacking a card. Uh -huh. And then drawing the card. Uh -huh. Synchro plagues gets banished. Catastor. Oh, he's contesting, all right. Litho. Draw off a soul. And let me see the extra. Did you get anything cool this week? Ooh, Starving Venom. That's why you asked me about Super Poly. Okay. Maybe. Uh, so, Beat Cop, Space Insulator, and Dispatch Parazzi. Um, then I will cycle Void Beckoner. Dude, you're so good at this game. True. You have Catastrophe the counter. Okay. I will... Betrayal Flesh. Summon Perfect Ass. Tribute Perfect Ass. Yo, I'll get Probe. Show me the hand. Yeah. Uh, da, 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 da. 
Yikes. That's a scary looking hand. Are you sure? You have the tension sphere and mimeoplasm. I would say that's kind of scary. Um, let me see here. You have 11 cards in the grave, 1 card in banish, 4 monsters on field, all of whom represent near lethal damage and a full grip. I'd say my hand's kind of, uh, not very scary. I mean, I was just thinking, like... Now you do. Yeah. Um, Brassel! Wait, no, that's That's 1900? That, that's wrong. <laughs> Take the 100? Yup, I'm stupid. <laughs> Whatever. It's fine. Okay, take a hundred. Twenty-four hundred. Twenty-two hundred. I can't be like. Still twenty-two. What? Catastrophe's twenty-two. Yeah, right? Catastrophe just has death touch. I don't know why I gave Catastrophe death touch since it already essentially has it. Against darks, yeah. Yo, you summon a dark monster. You fucked. I don't know how I just threw that away. I wasn't thinking. Activate Goblin War Party. Sure. Tribute. Oh, uh, tribute to Mimeoplasm. Um. I'm trying to think what you could use this to. A lot. Oh, yeah, because Void Beckoner is 32. <laughs> you know what? That's fine. Okay, copy Void Beckner and its effects, then I'll gain an attack and defense equal to the, uh, um, what do I want to gain attack and defense equal to? Yeah, let's just see my Weathering Soldier. So now I'm at, uh, what are we at here? 5200. So we're at, uh, 5200 and, uh, 4400, and its effects are after damage calculation and spells. It, it has that touch. Card to card drop. Doesn't really matter. Okay, so this is 5400. Cool. 5400 with Death Touch. Next we will. Tension Sphere. Aha! There we go! The Tension Sphere targeting your Catastor. Ah, my K Tester. Alright. Next we will go to battle. Yep. I will attack into your. that guy. So it's 5400, right? Kick 19, yeah. 29, actually. 29, yeah. Alrighty. Cool. We'll set a card. And... End turn. So I think that's the counter spell you have. Well, uh, you have lost the game, Nick. I will target Mimeoplasm, Detention Sphere, and your face uh, turn. Counter spell? Can I contradict? Oh, yep, I lose. So destroy three things, so bye, bye, bye. Tokens? I didn't destroy one of your tokens. You destroyed like, three I, things, yeah. No, I destroyed your counter spell. You countered it with Contradict, and then Violent Ultimation destroyed three cards. I target three cards. It targets, so I targeted your Mimeoplasm, your, uh... Pod Why would you counter- Why would you target the counter spell? Because it gets rid of it anyway. No matter what happens. And plus, I still have lethal, because it doesn't Dissension Sphere- But why would you count target the counter spell if it's already being countered? Because I have enough monsters to lethal you. Okay. You had enough monsters least me anyway. Funk. Anyway. Yeah, let's try this again. Oh, baby. Interesting. Special summon. The DB thing hates you. Holy shit. Oh, yeah, it does for some reason. How, how am I this fucking lucky? What the fuck? I don't understand this shit. How do I keep seeing this um, card? Normal summon. Sure. Set one. Yep. Go ahead. Stand by face. Watcha. Uh. Yikes. Sure. So I can't. I am, uh, yeah, uh, at least I can set a monster. 
Thick. Oh, okay. Sick! Uh, we will... Tribute. Niv Mizzet. Hmm, okay. Go for ten. Nothing good. Well, we can tell these ads with my hand. Yeah. Oh no, you saw my drowning mirror force. Oh no! Mirror force! Hey, that card's actually cracked, though. <laughs> Wait, you're playing trap cards now. Now I can slide in Jinzo. It'll actually do something. Anyway, attack. Gear frame. Cool. 24. Short. And now I lose. Go ahead. I'm gonna start with Skull Rend. My last card that rips shit out. Cool. Take 800 and then... Number 3! My Balaslamia. There we go. My Jade Leech. No! The cards you added off Nim Visit. No! Anyways, I'm Couldn't very, really I'm, ver I'm very sorry. <sighs> Man, I wish I was good at this game. I don't know why this game keeps giving me the draw threes every fucking game. You realize this is like the fifth game in a row where I've opened Brilliant Plan? Yeah, I know. some fucking bullshit. Okay. I feel so bad for you, I'm sorry. I feel- no, I'm feeling bad for you considering I don't understand why DB start, keeps giving me the draw threes to start. Probably show you that, shouldn't I? Probably. There you go. Oh, my hammer. Okay. I was um, really hoping you'd make hand. you discard uh, Dog Scapper. Oh, that would have been interesting. We'll start with Sidra. Thrill. Thinking on what? I'll pitch Army. Grave. Grave. Litho. I'll rip the same three as I did last time. I will reveal target force. Yeah, that's fine. And then summon him to pot. Man, I love Zaborg. Don't yeah, Zaborg's you? so good, especially when Zaborg can target multiple cards if you uh, activate them multiple turns in a row. Take your 100, oh baby. Oh no. One whole hundred? And then 24. And then special Mahama. And then, are you gaining or dealing? Uh, I'll deal. Okay. Make it look closer than it actually is. Okay. We'll activate Thassa's intervention. I'll pay 2k. Look at, uh, four Yo, cards. Yo, let's go! I think we're always taking War Party. Okay. And then do we want Rickthar or Mimeoplasm? Let me look at the graveyard right now. We'll get the lad. The, the Mimeoplasm. Boy, the lad, the boy. Oops. Boom, top deck. Kick top you. <laughs> bottom of deck, bottom of deck. Okay. Okay, okay. Activate my war party. Sure. Kadoosh. Kadoosh. Kadash. Oh, baby. We will tribute. Yep. We will banish Niv Mizzet and copy him. And um, we will banish your big dude. My big chonking lad. Yep. Alright, 5k. 10. What happens here? Ooh, spicy. Yo, a hand trap. Do I take them or Theo? Well, there's nothing in special summon Theo, so I'll we'll take two hands. Bro, the fucking shuffler really gave you a worse version of Git Probe? What the fuck? That's so mean. And two hands. 
what do you say? The the shuffler, like the fucking randomizer gave you a worse version of Git. Oh yeah. That's so mean. I know. I was there. Anyway. <laughs> Pardon? Hey yo, you were linking off Mimeoplasm? I didn't do nothing. That was all DB. <laughs> Gotta love DB, baby. Anyway, battle phase. Yep. Hiya. Yeah. I will take, take 25. 25. Go ahead. Ooh, okay. Stand by main. Yeah. Actually, fuck. Uh, whatever. I just need to stop playing trap decks because I can never remember. Do I ogre spare supplies? Oh, do you? Are you going to? <laughs> no. I'm gonna skull plant. I, I really hate to fucking get rid of Tetsi Mock, but you know what? That 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 also solves my fucking problem, huh? Yeah, there you go. But I want to do it the cool way. We're gonna act on impulse first. See what we get. Okay. I told you you had to draw a spell in hand. We did, but I like Tetsuma. Getting rid of Tetsuma is so fun. That wasn't a great one, huh? Anyway. Hey, you can all use Gelb as tribute material. What do you got there? What do we see here? Sick. I need Jade Leech. Double Monster Reborn! Yo! Do you, do you have Machina? No. It's an 1800 Earth. Beater. Overlay! Shokan! Mm. Silent Honor Arc! Mm. Wait, fuck. Neoplasm wasn't special summons. It was normal summon, correct. I f always forget that Silent Honor Arc needs to target special summon monsters. You can monsters. take a token or Mahama. Sure, I'll take your token. Or no, your Mahama. Ooh, I, I, can't, will, uh... I can't steal tokens. I'm gonna Ghost Ogre. Okay. Um, this is not looking good. Want a dark hole? Set one. And uh, you want a dark hole in hand? I yes. I was like, oh, I can win this way, but I want to do it the cool way, aka summoning Silent Honor Arc. Then I realized <laughs> too late that Just Honor Arc right sucks. Way. Silent Honor anyway, Arc's not as good as I thought. Battle phase. Draw. Um, put away? Uh, 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 yeah. Thick. If only I just actually dark hold instead of fucking going for the honor arc. Yeah, it was funny. I would call that pretty stupid. Oh, damn. Okay, get probe. Hey, you're not gonna like this. Unless you have the uh, discard spell. I'm fucked. I am I mean, so fucked. Fine, if as I long don't as you have ability to uh, get to uh, lethosagism. <laughs> fuck, 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 fuck. What do I do? <laughs> I like those sounds. Ah. <laughs> uh. Um, uh, hmm, 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 hmm. Normal plagues. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, army. Mm hmm I will cycle void beckoner. Please. You know what? That that's that's good. We're starting to get somewhere. Okay. There he goes. Now he draws all the draw spells. We'll go insulator. Tragic lesson. Don't know how much better this is gonna be. We'll discard super nimble mega hamster. Oh, there it goes. It was, it was a DB moment thing. True. Gotta love it. Now he, yep, there he goes. It was did, it, did, it, did it not banish? I, okay, that was weird. Yo, dragon rulers? I have no fucking clue. This, this card doesn't make, like, any sense. It um, doesn't work in Yu-Gi-Oh, no. Yeah, not really. Well, that is my turn, I think. Cool. What do we I got here? Might oh, have missed sick. something, okay. but like. Don't want someone Jade Leech? Sure. 
Sure. Sure. Sure. Sure. Cool. Yeah. Battle. Yeah. I'll take eight. Main two. I should have activated this first. I'm an idiot. Oh well. F. Uh, I'll special some quarter. Yeah, That's fine. Um. What are these? Level? These are level seven, right? Yes, sir. Normal gub. Yo, make an eight. Yep. Everybody's favorite RDA. Yo. Oh, you know what? This is very funny. I'm also oh, I like funny. Uh, target Void Beckoner. Sure. And with my two level eights, I will build the overlay network! Okay. Hope Harbinger! Sick. I, I put this card in because I was like, I have three eights. I might be able to summon this thing. <laughs> um, As for... I'm just going to attack... Um, we are going to Rusty's admonition. Want to negate it? Okay. Um, in response to the effect, Fuck. we are going to polymorph Jess, turn everything into a one-one blue frog. Well, shit. Uh, where's the? There we go. I have been fucked over. Rude. You've been owned. Yes. Anyways, I'm gonna reveal. Sick. Put that counter on, baby. Yeah. Man, um, we will summon Hope Permanent. We got it outed immediately. Now I'm sad. Toy Knight. Sure. Uh, we will make. We will make Firewall Exceed Dragon. Interesting. Sure. Okay. Next, we will activate from under the floorboards. It, yeah. Yep. Okay. Token, token, token. Tokens. Who cans? We will get rid of two two cans. Well, it's not me. What's up? Did none of your like Nothing. monsters point to XE Dragon? Oh, well, they will, but... Okay. So, this gets uh, 1,000 attack. Yep, so 35. Uh, man, I screwed up. I should have... Anyway. Are you saying Battle like you, you should have put the token in attack? No, I shouldn't have made Firewall Exceed Dragon. I should have just gone for the Boral Sword. Uh, that's fair. And then I didn't deal any damage to you, so... Go ahead. Stand by man. Cyber Dragon. Yep. I will soul charge some more tokens. Dude. Is, is it crazy to believe that this is not even one of my most broken cards? Yeah. Soul charging tokens? Not even that good when I have all this other shit. Uh, I mean, we'll do it. Okay. Zaborg. What'd you target? I targeted XCs for the Predator token. Okay. Or Ooh. Prey token. Um. I mean. I shall go to battle. Dang, that sucks. Anyway, uh, draw two. Yo, he got a f another pot of greed. Yeah, they're still. Wait, isn't this just in all your cards? Isn't this just sign in blood? Yeah. Okay. Oh, it's three mana. Ah, oh, okay. I'll look at your hand. It's Neat. Dark hole. I will detention sphere your Tetsamok. I'll set a card and I will pass. Alright. I assume. Upkeep, I draw a card. Mm, actually, yeah, I'll just go battle and swing. 
You absolute idiot. My dot paper. <laughs> no! What am I gonna do? How do I beat Dotscaper? I actually can't do anything right now. I don't feel like dark holding this. Oh, you absolute buffoon. Am I gonna lose to Dotscaper? He's tributing so much. Rurik Thar. I... Bring back Dotscaper because you sent to the graveyard. I'm gonna floodgate the yes, Rurik Thar. Uh, still can't get over Dotscaper. Nor Rurikthar this time. True. Oh, God. So what happens if you attack into Rurikthar? Uh, he'll flip up to defense position. Cool. Then I guess he's like no longer effective. I don't know, man. I don't know what the fuck I'm supposed to do. I'm just sitting here like an idiot. God. I'm going to make the thumbnail Dotscaper and say, This is the scariest card ever. The unstoppable force versus the immovable object. No, I could have outed it if I wasn't a dumbass earlier in the game. <laughs> I fucking ah uh, damn. I think I can still do it, but it's so much more investment, and I hate it. Mhm. Mm Normal Arabellum. Okay. We are going for the ultimate Trish. I will put away your Fuck! Trash. And I can just shuffle a card from my graveyard into my library. I will I'm... shuffle in... Um... Oh, there's some good options. I think I'll shuffle in... Polymorph's Jest. They're beating your ass in the quote retweets. Okay. That's not horrible. Um, we'll normal summon my Axe Dragonet. Sure. Alright, go ahead. Stand by me. Then we're in token or whatever. I have to. It feels so. It feels like such dog shit. Yeah, you have to. Language, baby. Oh, baby. I just, just had to make sure that the effects of. Uh, I um... really, I really had to spend a dark hole to get rid of Dotscaper of all things. Yes. Best card in the game! This guy. Fuck! Take 200 and discard a card. I will discard a card, but I will. Oh, I wait. oh wait, nope, you don't have to because you didn't take battle damage. True! I've just been holding on to this fucking Skull Ren until you get a goddamn another card I can discard. Stand by me. Let's go, mathematician! Okay. Uh, you know what? We'll send the funny Lurgoif. That's to hand. God damn it. You wish. I wish I had fucking Lurgoif in hand. Um. I don't have a Synchro 4. I do have a Synchro 5. Uh huh. Cataster. Oh, he's Catastin. Wait, and these guys are... The tokens are nines, right? I think. You got a rank nine? Yeah. No, I don't have rank nines. Yeah, they're nines. Uh, gub. Oh, yeah, you can make what's it says. Uh, mill. We'll make ready rows. Just realize, uh, why did I take so long to fucking do this? I could have been doing this a while ago. <laughs> I'm stupid, okay. You actually in uh, the effect of Ready Rose? No, I'm not. Okay. Just in case I get like a reborn spell. Should Gub be banished? Uh, Gub, it, Plague should be banished. Gub should not. Gub, yeah. Gub doesn't banish itself, it's just one sprinkle. Oh, that sucks. Damn. Well, that stinks. Yeah, you got it. Oh, fuck. I could have done I that a couple I drew a Johnny times. for turn, and then I had a Ghost Ogre in hand, which is why I was hoping oh, to get a Ruddy Rose. Oh, you know what? Yeah, that would have been pretty fucking good, huh? Mm-hmm. 
Well, it went better, but uh, you're still way too cracked, my guy. I have not been able to summon Squirrel Dealer. I want to ask someone if they like squirrels again. I also pulled the Nazi. I like squirrels. I oh, good. Ah. Uh, anyways, um. Deck, 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 decky time. Time for the decks. Woo -hoo -hoo. True. The only things I really added this week, I think, are the Lurgoif. And. What else did I add? The Psychic Commander. I think those were the only nice. two. I had a decent amount of that. So I added the Narciss Reversal, I added the uh, Draw 2, I added the uh, View from Hand card. Oops, hit my mic. Oof. I got a Revival spell, which is pretty good. Well, not a Revival um, spell, a Return to Hand spell, but uh, yeah. I just pay increments of 500 and I get that I also see you got back to my hand. Divining Top. Yeah, it's okay in this format. I think looking at the top three is pretty good when you have draw spells. Yeah. Um, what else did I do this week? Uh, I got a new 2k beater, so that was fun. Nice. Oh, I got the most cracked card in existence, and, um, I'm so mad I didn't get to see it. What card's that? Uh, Pelucranos. Alright, so you wanna hear what this guy does? Sure. Let me just find a... Alright, so we got Pelucranos Unchained. So, he is a 4 star, 0, zero. He enters the battlefield with 6 plus 400 plus 400 counters on him. Alright. If you summon him from the graveyard, he is summoned with 12 plus 400 plus 400 counters. Hmm. If he would be dealt damage, instead remove a counter. That's interesting. Once per turn, he can fight another creature. Oh. Exile 6 cards, revive it from my graveyard. That's interesting. Mm-hmm. I'm very sad I didn't see him this week. But um, he was my coolest pickup. Oh, I also added this the uh, the counter trap that's discard a card negate the effect of a spell card. Yeah, jammer. Yeah, not um, jammer. Um, like spell canceling circle or something like that. Oh, it's called magic jammer. There's a different one. Magic jammer is not counter trap. I don't think. Oh yeah. Okay. Anyways, what is the ban today? I don't know. I want to ban my draw I three because I see it every fucking game. Yeah, I'm bit sure I'll ban that. You will draw it every single game. It's ridiculous. You're just too good. Too also, crap. Also, card's called Cursed Seal of the Forbidden Spell. Ah. Oh, that's the one that makes it so I can't activate games with it for mm -hmm. the rest of the game. Well, magic funny card. Card. Counter trap. Oh well. Uh. But yeah, anyways. It's funny. Um. I'm half expecting to. Uh. Also, after. Uh. Like sometime during the week be like, oh yeah, reverse engineers also banned. Yeah. But anyways, um that one was kinda long surprisingly. Um but I hope you all enjoyed. Comment and subscribe really helps the channel. And if you want to see more, you know, oh where to look. Bye bye. Bye.